Salki Valley Transparency. I'm here in Santa Maria. And we are in Santa Maria today. And I want to dedicate this audit to Oklahoma's Community Watch. It's been supporting my channel from, very, from the very beginning, since day one. And uh, he asked me if I could come out here and do an audit. And here we are. This one's for you, Chewy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So let's go see. They respect our rights to report the public. Here we have a police cruiser that's idling. I didn't even notice that it was not California. Mm -hmm. Realized that the officer's parked in the red zone. Santa Maria Mayor. Yes. Yeah. Yolanda? It's going to be 1480. There's the Santa Maria Mayor Alice. There's the Santa Maria Mayor Alice Haiti. Here, Randy, with you. There's the Santa Maria Mayor Alice Patino. service in the most efficient, cost-effective, and courteous manner possible. Okay. Okay. So, if I want to come to the highway, that would put the different, right? How you doing? Good, how are you? Not too bad. How you doing? Good. You filming the documentary? Really? Um, well, kind of. Just oh. going around the community filming. Oh, Me too. Okay. I'm just gonna get a complaint form. Can I have a complaint form, please? Excuse me. Oh, we're closed. All right, sir. The, vol the volunteer. Oh, I'll get that form right here. Yeah. He's closing the window on here. Yes. Or he got upset. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss. Can I borrow your restroom? I'm sorry, sir. The lobby's closed. Bullshit. Lobby's closed. How do you come in then to uh, make a report? Okay, thanks. Will you will you be the pleasant one that answers? No, sir. That's a good task. Okay. Thank you. Can I borrow your restroom now? It's locked. She locked it. Just do it. Just do it in the corner. Show them who's boss. <laughs> <laughs> They helped the lady before us, but they just closed it on us. She wanted no part of it. Hell no. Santa Maria, we might even be here two days. We might be here a week. We might be here a month. We might be here all year long, every day, the next 10 years, in your lifetime. Through your whole career, officers will be here watching you guys. If not me, somebody else will. We got more and more channels popping up every day. It ain't just me doing it. I don't want to be number one. I don't want to be anything other than just being a part of it. I am just like you. Whether you have one subscriber, you all do it 
for your own reasons and I'm with you. I'm with you. I won't, I won't act like I'm supporting you and then troll you behind your back. I'm not a backstabber. I'm not a jealous person. I'm not afraid of competition. I don't say something and then do something else. I'm not a hypocrite. I'm not a fake ass friend. If you feed me, I'll feed you. And that's just how it is. You take care of me and I'll take care of you. Who's not California right there? Solid ass dude. He's not a fake activist. He's a real activist. We go out, uh, we're activists. We go out and keep the police accountable, all government agencies accountable. Make sure our tax dollars are being spent in the right way. And they don't like us filming, but it's our right to film. You have no expectation of privacy once you leave your home. Everybody's afraid of a camera. When you go anywhere, there's 10 cameras on you. Post offices, they don't like us filming, but they have a poster in there, rules and regulations. Oh. So, and we're not anti-cop, mm -hmm. but we're anti-bad cop. And you could, you were in there, you could see her attitude, right? Her attitude. Yeah, because I told her, because I had a ticket right off, right? Right. And I told, and she could have told me it was 1495. Right. She could have told me. And then I said, what if I want, went to, to the highway patrol? She said, oh, it should have been free. I go, well, why didn't you tell me? Right. Because that's what they do. Yeah. They, they do that to you to screw you over oh and to God. take your money. I Very, well, they're always unprofessional. Well, I wonder if I could, I can't get their money back because they're already signed, right? Like, you know what? Uh, because she should have, I go, well, he should have told me. Well, we can call. You want us to uh, help you out? We'll go, come on with us. We'll make a call and see what they say. Let's go. Fourteen ninety-five. we'll do it for free. <laughs> Get your money back. Can't hurt. All you got to do is park the car. Dispatch is, dispatch is going to say they're closed. You're going to have to come back tomorrow. Yeah, that's what they'll do. That's what do. dispatch yeah. is going to say. But, but they should have said, oh, yeah. you know what? I this advise is, you to go. This is what they do. It's they're very free. unprofessional. I know. I know. It's I know. very. It, they're very unprofessional. Because, they're, you know, the when the police officer didn't, he said, go to the police. I thought it would be free. Right. And then I came here, and then I said, would you agree that policing has become a business? More yes. of a business than anything? Oh, $14. Would, wouldn't it be nice if they weren't able to generate revenue? They're just able to go catch killers and, 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 and really do and catch bad people, but not to go in and generate revenue waiting behind for you to even pass a stop sign by an inch so they can ticket I you. I mean, they're. See, right, this one I didn't agree because I dropped off my, my boy. Uh huh. In the, Everybody drops them off there at the school right. on Thornburn. Right. right. At the fairgrounds. He just dropped them off. He, he gave me a, well, he didn't give me a ticket, but he gave me like a warning. Right. Right. Because I didn't have my license. Right. He says the next time it's going to be a ticket. So why, and then I always see them parked there. Right. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the parents drop their sure. children right. off. They love to mess the, with you. The other day, why are they there? on my YouTube channel, I stopped, I, I went to, I walked up to a police officer who was parked and trying to ticket parents running a stop sign. He was hiding. And I went up to him and I told him, I says, you know, I was like, we don't need you here, man. We're the parents. We can take care yeah. of our kids. You know, we don't need you ticketing parents. Let the parents yes. go home. They're probably tired. They want to go home. These, tic these parents don't need tickets. Yeah, they hide. And he left. Yeah. I made him leave. The officer left. But let me ask you this. Are you Santa Maria High School already took them off on the other side. Pull they... You want to pull really? over? Oh. Let this guy come over this way. <laughs> so do you agree that policing has become more of a business than more it has? Business, yeah. yeah. Let me ask you this. Are you a good person? Do you break? Do you go around breaking laws and... Do you do you take do you work to take care of your family? Yes. You know you have you do you do, are you a good person? Do you have a good so. heart and, and yes. you, you know? Yes. So this proves that even good people are and understand what what we do, what we're talking about, and um, we're not bad people. They like to call us terrorists and they get all afraid because of a camera and stuff like that. But in reality, they get paid a lot of money. A lot of money and that's all they care about is to obey what they're told so they don't screw up their hundred thousand dollars a year paychecks 
and they get paid a lot of money and they think that they have power over the people when in reality they work for us until we break the law so and we need every if if people pulled out their phones and recorded every interaction not just with police but with the dmv every interaction with our public officials that we paid our tax dollars to if everybody recorded they they, they would have to stop the practice of racism in the united states they can't they can't do it in front of the camera so that's why we do it unfortunately we have to go out people from the united states all the way from sea to shining sea not an organization we're not antique or nothing like that people just picking up cameras and going there and holding them accountable make sure that they act professional to all people and we go around we we and we we go if we see a police pull somebody over we'll pull over and we'll record them make sure that that they don't shoot that person or just for for no reason at all it's just like they you know you should have been nice oh, i advise you to go home. Why? Why were you even paying fourteen bucks for? It? What is that? Because for? she had to write it off for the officers, just to right. see if. Because when they stopped me, I didn't have my driver's license, but I, I knew. But I knew my number. I see. So he says, "Okay, well, I'm going to give you, you know, fix it to you." Uh huh. This is how you get him back. And then, you know, I, <coughs> why didn't she say? You. Well, being a nice person, I I would have if I were. Why don't yeah. you go to the? Well, that's why you're not the working for them. <laughs> Why don't you go to the highway patrol and you get it for free? Right. She tells you after you pay. No, because I ask. I go, I go, what if... Right. Oh, no, I ask. Well, can, if, um, can the highway patrol, can they write off these kind of tickets too? And she said, yes, I go, if I would have been over there, how much would I pay? She said, it would be free. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, 14 <laughs> bucks coming through, you know? Well, this, is a, this is a business, a like I said. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Watch, watch our channels. Oh. You know, um, you, you, you know how I spell San Joaquin, like San Joaquin yeah. Valley. I was born in San Joaquin Valley. Okay, type in San Joaquin. That's my channel. I was name. born in Antica. Really? Mm -hmm. Um, so uh, my channel is called San Joaquin Valley Transparency. Oh. Just type in San Joaquin. You're gonna see me right there with the camera. Oh, okay. Subscribe on YouTube. Watch our videos. Share them with friends and family so that they can learn their rights. That's San what Joaquin. we do, San Joaquin. And this guy is news now, California. We got two, two pretty, pretty good sized channels, mm -hmm. and we go out and record. We have people donating to us. Police officers, retired police officers donating to us. Uh, a, a guy donated a drone to me the other day to help me out. Um, I mean, it's just it's just so a just wonderful San thing. Joaquin Valley or just, San Joaquin? just type in San Joaquin, you'll see me. But On my YouTube. channel's yeah, oh, my channel's right. San Joaquin Valley Transparency, oh, okay. and his News Now California. Yeah, News Now California. Oh. Check but it just out. if you type in San Joaquin, yeah, you you won't miss me. You'll but be, oh, you only do this like at the police or everywhere. Everywhere. We go to the schools, CIA, I mean, DEA. We prisons. go to. Uh, schools? Internal affairs. Schools. You know what? You know, uh, some of us, some of us are starting to do the school districts though, and school districts need to be because we don't like to go to schools where there's kids and stuff. Yeah. But there's no kids at the school districts, and that's where we can yeah. go and ask questions and right. stuff like that. You know, like my daughter. Um, you know, she, but the school children that go to school, say like the high school. Right. You know, they have rights too because I have my boy go to high school. Right. And he says, you know, like. A lot of children don't even get a chance to eat because the lines are so and there's only like one right small cafe. i go well you guys have you know you guys could speak up mm -hmm. say we you oh, know yeah. we want you know oh, yeah. they, they can't leave campus mm -hmm. so they don't eat until they come home at and sometimes people won't listen until you put the camera on them and then you speak up and put the camera and then they have to listen because then you post it and people make phone calls for us if these people right here act, act unprofessional they're, this police station might get phone calls because of what they, the way they behaved with us. So, this is how we put them in check. What was your name? Yolanda. My name is David. <laughs> San, you can call me San Joaquin. I'm Philip. San Joaquin. Pleasure, Yolanda. Pleasure. Okay. And and those fourteen dollars was well spent because you learned something today. I know. And, and you met if some YouTubers. You met some YouTubers. Okay. Grab some YouTuber. popcorn. <laughs> grab some popcorn and watch and enjoy and learn learn your rights and teach your family. Have a wonderful night, Yolanda. Have a wonderful Bye -bye. night. Bye-bye. She was nice. Yeah. yeah. That's right. And that's how we get them one by one. Educate them. Show them. One by one, folks. Uh, looked like I just got me one more subscriber. I'm getting pretty close to 50,000. If you guys are watching this, subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to News Now California. Subscribe to Public Photography. Subscribe to Tulare County Cop Watch. Subscribe to Mr. Scientifical. Subscribe to Casey Camera Boy. Subscribe to Ida Foxy Queen. 
Subscribe to SGV News First. Subscribe to Auditing America. What else do we got? Subscribe to Irate Productions and San Diego Cop Watch. Subscribe to Ricky Monday. Subscribe to Tom Zebra. I love you, Tom. And 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 just want you to know that uh, your brother Hank uh, bought me beers the other night, man. And I uh, just want to say thanks to Hank Zebra for always supporting me and my channel, and for buying me and all my friends beers because he appreciates what we do. So, peace out.